So, uh, he's not trying to. So, so if um, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get under here to get his arm. Okay, if the guy's got posture and all that, that's fine. You know, I might have to pull him down a little bit. But the main thing what I'm doing is if I get a collar grip, that might help me. I'll get a collar sleeve just to kind of get him down on me a little bit. But I'm gonna dig under here and lean toward this and I'm just hugging this arm. See how I'm, I'm gripping like this. If he, if I don't get a collar grip or this is no gi or maybe he's too far forward, I'll unlock my feet and then I'll dive for this. So I'm just, I'm just grabbing his arm and I'm holding this here. Now, depending on what happens, you have a couple of options. So I like to have my forearm here and this is here. Some people play this guard like this. I don't do this all the time. I like to do this. So even if I grab the guy like here, I'll switch off to this, all right? Okay, so I've got this grip. At the beginning, all this depends on where he puts his arm. He might pull his arm back towards his hip. He might put his arm, kind of try to wiggle his arm out by your head, okay? You know, he might grab your head. This happens, then he'll yank his elbow in. These are all options. So we're gonna go based on that. The first one is you grab his arm, he keeps his wrist kind of close to his body. You're gonna do what's called a reverse Kimura. So I take my hand, I grab my bicep, and I'm grabbing for his wrist here. If I can get his hand, cool, but I'm locking here. I scoot away so I get his hand away from my hip, and then I turn like a regular Kimura. It's the same move, just your hands are backwards. I hold this here and I pull this. I gotta keep his elbow close, and I pull here, okay? So again, I'm fighting for here, I'm going. I'm just digging for his arm. Yeah, he pulls his arm back here, grip, I grab the bicep. If I get here, it's fine. My fingers are messed up so I can't grab, but I grab the bicep here. This part, a lot of people will, won't do this part, but I, I suggest doing this because he's gonna grab my pants or grab his hip. Like, yeah, you don't you don't want that. So when he once you grab his hand, scoot out this way, so his arms away. Get a good grip, and you'll turn it. Okay. Now some people will get this grip to get it here, and they have trouble finishing. That's fine. Switch off, and then pass it back, and use that as the way to get it. All right. So let's start. You get the underhook kind of guard, and then we'll go to that. Let's go. One, two, three.